What? Santosh, it's coming up. There it goes. Um, everyone can see my screen, I assume. I can, but please let us know in, in chat or somewhere if, if the people who are not panelists cannot see it. Okay. Thanks, Angie. Um, myself, uh, let me introduce myself. Um, most of you may know me, but I've been with IBI for close to seven years. Um, primarily throughout this tenure, I manage different data products. I'm currently responsible for IBI's data management portfolio with focus on data quality and master data intelligence. In my previous uh, life and in my previous role, I managed uh, clinical data integration projects for a large uh, healthcare insurer. So that experience has helped me bring some insights as an end user and how technology can help improve um, the overall experience for data professionals and deliver continuous business value. Um, so in in, the, in this section of this presentation, as you can already um, uh, realize, that we are going to discuss the transformative power of IBI's data products, especially its profound impact on data analytics, business intelligence, and data science in, in initiatives. We'll explore how portfolio of data products serves as the cornerstone for unlocking that true potential of your data assets. As business analysts, I always think you are storytellers. As you are analyzing data, applying intelligence, creating new insights for your business, you often encounter bad data, incomplete data, inaccurate data. And slowly, data becomes the antagonist in your story. So in, if, if I were to give one-liner for IBI's data products, the role that these products play is the role of transforming that da data from a villain to a hero in your story. Um, since data is undoubtedly uh, the lifeblood of your decision making, this is a very valuable resource. And uh, this valuable resource doesn't uh, exist in one place. It exists in fragmented, isolated silos. Um, and there are challenges in your ability in deriving meaningful insights. So uh, uh, the top portfolio of our products, the data integration and application integration products, they are designed to tear down those walls that isolate information that are in various corners of your organization, facilitate seamless data integration, bring data together from dis disparate sources. Then we have a, um, uh, a unification, a set of products that help you aggregate and unify data by harmonizing this information from different sources into canonical data entities where you can manage the relationships between those entities and add some business context and relevance. Once that data is unified, we have products that help you improve consistency, accuracy of your data, help you cleanse your data, validate, enrich the data, ensuring that the decisions you're making are based on trustworthy uh, information. And finally, uh, one of the most critical uh, aspects of any data management platform is governance. Um, our products help you enforce governance policies, ensuring compliance with both your internal and external partners, uh, government regulations, safeguarding your sensitive information. So we provide that framework uh, for responsible data management. As we look, uh, take a little more of a deeper dive into individual product areas, I also wanted to highlight some of the key underlying principles that are going to influence our product roadmaps. Number one is usability. We are very, very focused on not just adding new features, but on the usability aspect of those features, especially ease of use, simple deployment plans, ease of administration, automation wherever it's possible, uh, to lend a more of an overall uh, simpler uh, and maybe a delightful user experience. We have revamped product documentation. We are committed to doing more user en enablement. We had different forums, uh, user groups, educational content, et cetera. Second important aspect, and that uh, applies to the data side of things, is scalability. Our core architecture across the products is evolving into a more of a microservices architecture. So you can you have different components that can scale with your needs. This gives immense flexibility and agility in how you want to allocate your precious resources, how you how and when you want to run your jobs, meet SLAs, and adapt with your growing data and business needs. And then the last one is cloud readiness. Uh, Almost every new product that we have is containerized from the ground up. This simplifies the configuration, gives you the, the flexibility to deploy 
uh, and run these applications on-prem, on-cloud, hybrid, however you want. So those are our three key underlying principles. As you look at our product roadmaps, you'll see most of our features um, uh, aligning with those principles. So let's take a look at our flag uh, flagship products in the application and data integration product uh, space. We have IWA Service Manager that comes with the Trading Partner Manager, the Business Activity Monitor, and we have a very robust uh, ETL engine and data migrator. These products help you build, manage, and operationalize your data pipelines, uh, whether it's in support of various data analytics de uh, demands or other uh, various use cases where you want to efficiently manage partners in your data ecosystem, maybe modernize and automate your workloads, maybe seamlessly integrate and interoperate with other products to create that crucial bridge within your data management e ecosystem. So in this space, while we continue to invest in core capabilities like API management, mapping, transformation, routing capability, we are increasingly embracing cloud-based integration solutions by adding new connectors, Azure Queue, Google PubSub, that bridge the gap between legacy systems and modern cloud environments. We are also simplifying the workflow orchestration features with uh, intelligent flow routing, component wizards, design time debuggers, and modernization of UI that will enable design and aut automation of your complex business processes as they evolve into a more of a holistic solution in your space. On the data quality side, and um, this is one space that is very close to my heart because I've been involved in creating this product uh, over the last couple of years with an army of uh, very intelligent people around me. But uh, almost a year ago, we introduced this brand new DQ product that replaces the older generation of Omnigen DQ products. And it is not just an upgraded version, it is a brand new product um, where we primarily focused on, again, uh, ease of use. Uh, we have a bunch of no-code features. This product is completely enabled on a browser, so you have browser-based interactions. And we focus on non-tech business and citizen users of data. Uh, second aspect of, or second key highlight of this product is reusable. Hey, we have- Hey, Santosh. Really quick, I don't, I don't know if you're, if you're moving slides on your side. I still see the first slide. I just want to make sure I'm not the only one. Oops, oh, there we go. Sorry. Now it's moving. Sorry. No okay. worries. Uh, sorry. Uh, are we, are we seeing the data quality data, slide? Right? I see data quality now. Yes. I apologize. I don't know why there was a lag. Anyways, um, going back. Uh, so uh, the second key highlight of our data quality, new data quality of product offering is reusable. We have added a lot of out-of-box features, Google services, and we also have enabled lots of customizations through no-code features. So if you have a rule and you want to create one new rule, you could do that on a browser-based uh, interface through a few simple clicks. And because of these two usability and reusability aspects, we are also able to see wider adoption of this product. We are focused on robust API services that enable native integration. Maybe you have different products, and maybe the, those are IBI products, non-IBI products that want to integrate DQ in their data pipelines. We have enabled that through this robust set of API services. Every feature we release has an API in it, wherever it's applicable. And then apart from the core DQ features that you generally see profiling, classification, verification, validation, and enrichment, this product also comes with lots of advanced features, such as you can do your core relation analysis across different attributes in a data set. You can do cluster analysis. You can do sensitive data detection or identification and flagging. Uh, we collect a lot of DQ metadata. We generate DQ metrics and scores. There's, uh, that's all out of the box so that users can generate DQ reports. So there's a reporting application built into this DQ product. So users can proactively monitor, manage the quality of business critical data assets. And as we speak, uh, we are going through the final sign off So by this time next week or by next Friday, we are coming out with our next a release of DQ, which is some very exciting features. A couple of them are inspired by customer requests, uh, like enabling Python developers to deploy custom DQ scripts. Uh, we are adding a few new DQ rules and services. 
we have a feature that leverages DQ artifacts in MDM and our data migrator. And then we have done a lot of uh, uh, UI enhancement and uh, refresh, uh, refresh, uh, refresh the screens, the look and feel. So it's a pretty uh, good time to talk about uh, DQ if you're looking at it. It's coming out end of next week. Moving on, um, master data management. We we have quite a uh, quite a bit of journey in, the, in delivering master data intelligence. We have had one of the most versatile and powerful master data engines in the market. We have strong data orchestration capabilities in the OmniGen framework. And we also have patterns, which has a proprietary AI enabled matching engine leverages some of the most advanced algorithms and machine learning techniques to achieve real precise and efficient matching of data. We are consolidating all of these three products. Um, we are bringing to our customers a robust workflow engine, user configurable business rules to automate and streamline lots of uh, important pieces and parts in your processes such as, and tasks such as uh, record modification, change data capture, synchronization, publication, introduction of new records, uh, precedence and hierarchy management. As you can see, there's a lot of functionality that's built into this, including stewardship capabilities, which, which we believe will make this one of the most complete solutions in the market. And our focus is to grow this offering into a more unified and holistic solution, which brings me to my last slide, which is a unified data management uh, offering that we are bringing to our customers. It's a brand new, we're launching at the end of the month. It's a brand new product, which will give customers access to the entire data portfolio. Now, again, uh, this is not just a bundle of data products that we're putting together. There is truly integrated products in this stack with brand new and unified user interfaces, centralized user management, uh, simplified containerized deployment and configuration. I will not go into the details, but this is an exciting release for us, one of the biggest releases we have done. And why should you care about it? Um, two reasons. This gives you the best value going forward. You are future-proofing your investment in the data ecosystem because you get to access everything on the data side that's available today and you will have access to all the new products and innovations we deliver in the future. Also, with this release, we are going into a more of a consumption-based model, so you have no inherent processor restrictions. You are truly in control of your environment. You can add more resources to achieve that unparalleled performance that you need in your data jobs. Bottom line, uh, what we think is by transitioning to this single unified product, you'll achieve higher productivity, operational efficiency. You'll have maximum utilization of all of these data services across different user groups at a very affordable and predictable cost. With that, I will pause my um, presentation and take a, take a look at the Q&A to answer any questions.